Dearly beloved, loving greetings to you in the name of Lord Jesus Christ. The river Tamira Barani, which originates from Bodhigai Hills, joins the Bay of Bengal here in Punnakail. There is a fisherman village over here. People here are professional fishermen. This is one part of the river Tamira Barani. I am speaking to you from there. The environment over here is really pleasant to our eyes and it's a joy for me to speak to you from here. Now the Lord is giving you a word from Psalm chapter 84 and verse 5. Blessed is the man whose strength is in you, whose heart is set on pilgrimage. Blessed is the one whose heart is set on pilgrimage is what it's written over here. Blessed people means they are blessed by Lord God. You are blessed people. The Lord says, My son, my daughter, you are a blessed person. I will bless you and exalt you whatever you may be doing. The Lord promises so, but to receive this blessing in our lives, what does the Lord expect from us? He looks at our heart. Only those who have an upright heart can be a blessed people. If our heart is not upright or holy, God cannot bless us. The Lord says, Blessed are those who are pure in heart, for they will see God. So only when our heart is holy, we can see God. Your heart must be upright. It should not have unruly, wrong, deceiving, or cunning thoughts. The Lord cannot bless us if we harbor this kind of thoughts. God can bless us only when we possess an upright heart. But isn't it very hard to keep our hearts upright all the time? The Bible tells us that the heart is deceitful above all things and desperately wicked because it is from the heart of a man that evil thoughts, murders, adulteries, fornications, thefts, false witness, blasphemies come forth. Jesus Christ himself says so about a man's heart. So what must we do to keep the heart holy? The blood of Jesus Christ cleanses us from all sin. We have detergents to clean the stains in our clothes. We also have soaps for cleaning our body and shampoos for our hair. But how to clean the dirt from our hearts? It can be done only by the blood of Jesus Christ. That's why he shed his holy blood on the cross. That's why we must go to the Lord every day and ask him, Lord, cleanse my heart with your blood. Let my heart be upright and holy. If we could surrender ourselves and pray like this, an unseen miracle will happen in our life. His blood will wash and cleanse us. Then we will have a great joy and peace in our hearts. We will have the experience of seeing God. We will become a blessed people. Check your heart even today. Is your heart upright before the Lord God? If not, place your hand near your heart and pray, Dear Jesus, make my heart to be upright and holy. Please cleanse and sanctify my heart by your blood. I pray this prayer in the name of Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen.